running a new Giants coming in global market this year. We are proud to make a comparison between the two largest tractors of the world until now. An old and a new Titan are colliding for the title of the largest tractor of the agriculture history. So we decided to compare them and see who is the real giant. The comparison is a little bit unfair as we usually compare new against new tractors or old against old. But here we can make an exception and compare the largest electronic tractor ever of the new ages, against the largest tractor of the world of old ages. Subscribe us by the way, we know that you like this channel. So from one side we have the brand new John Deere 9RX 830 which is the largest model of 9RX series of John Deere and the largest new age electronic tractor, against the big butt V16 747 which is custom made farm tractor built in Hever Montana, in 1977. Both are something out of that planet as about size and power, so let's see which comes first on all levels. As about the engine. The new John Deere wears the X18 John Deere engine of 18 liters and 6 cylinders, it is the largest John Deere engine ever used and produced from this company. Big Bud from the other side wears a much larger engine, the Detroit Diesel 16 V92T of 24.1 liters and 16 cylinders, the difference is chaotic between these two with Big Bud still keeping the title of king of engines as no other tractor uses a so much large engine with 16 cylinders the same time, so Big Bud comes first here. But this is not probably an advantage on the fuel use that can be dramatic on this tractor as it is old. The rated power of the new Deere is at 830 horses and it can touch the 913 horses peak boosted power, it is the highest power from all new age tractors crawler or not until now. Big butt from the other side is higher rated power, at 1100 horses, the difference is again too big with Big Bud being the only one tractor of the world that's surpassing the 1000 horses power, so Big Bud takes the crown again on overall horsepower. The PTO power of the Deere is increased at 385 horses as the previous 9RXs don't surpass the 335. Big Bud's PTO power from the other side is not known yet, so we can't say which of the two comes first here. The peak torque of the Deere is at 4,234 newton meters at 1,400 revolutions per minute and here is the crazy thing, no other tractor, old or new on the world can touch a so high torque on so low RPM, Big Bud from the other side can touch a lower torque at 4200 newton meters on 3401 revolutions per minute so the deer here is the king of the torque surpassing big bud 747 and being the tractor of the highest torque on agriculture history deer can touch a higher torque on much lower rpm than big bud and this is a serious advantage as about the three point hitch capacities is not known yet from both tractors the pum rated out up of the deer is at 168 gpm buds is higher at 246 the top speed of the Deere is at 40 km per hour with 1,900 revolutions per minute engine speed, wearing the John Deere E2121 speed power shift with efficiency manager transmission and a max fuel tank capacity of 1,952 liters. The new updated innovation is that it requires no DEF tank unlike other new age tractors crawler or not. The cabine innovations will be public on next videos as this Deere is at the top of food chain it will take some time to find another new age crawler giant to compare it. Until now the 830 doesn't have an opponent at the global market. The top speed of Big Bud is at 30 to 40 km per hour with 2100 revolutions per minute engine speed, and it can touch the 13 km per hour at working speed by dragging a cultivator in the field. Deer's working speed is not known yet but we wish that it will be higher as the 830 is lighter with higher torque. The Big Bud wears the power shift transmission twin disc 6 forward and 1 reverse, and a max fuel tank capacity of 3,800 liters. It is the largest tank on a tractor until now and for sure it needs a so large tank for a so large engine size. As about the cabine innovations the tractor is old it does not include something special. This video is made more to compare the power and size of these two and not so much for the cabine innovations. Let's compare now the size of these behemoths. The Deer 830 basic weight is at 34,473 kg and it can touch the 38,100 kg of fully ballasted weight, it is the heaviest crawler tractor ever, Big Bud from the other side is heavier, with 48,000 kg shipping weight and it can touch the 68,000 kg fully ballasted with triple tires, the number is crazy and it will take some years more to be beaten by a new age tractor, the wheelbase of the Deer is at 4.6 meets and it is the largest wheelbase ever on a new age tractor. Big Bud from the other side has a larger wheelbase touching the 4.95 meters. The length of the Deer is at 8.8 .8 meters and it is the longest tractor of the agriculture history. The Bud is smaller with 8.2 meters length. The width of the Deer is at 3 meters, Bud is wider, with 4.6 meters width or 7.7 .7 meters with duals. 
The reason that 830 deer didn't build wider is because it could not move on the roads of some countries. The height of the cab of the deer is at 3.77 meters, but is taller at 4.3 meters. So, as a conclusion, the deer has higher torque on lower RPM than butt and this is the only thing that deer comes first between these two, also the deer is a longer tractor and probably faster because of the new age transmission it wears. Big butt from the other side still can't be beat it as it has higher rated power, larger engine with more cylinders, it is generally larger tractor and much heavier. We believe that the next step of the deer company is to surpass the 1000 horses, so we will wait to see what monster could beat the big butt numbers, so which of the two you believe could win a plow fight in the field? Waiting comments, we hope that you enjoyed this comparison and if you like subscribe us for more videos like this, until next time, see you.